what do you see? What do you see? Can you at least say good morning to everyone? Say good morning. Oh, you're back with it. Yes. Say good morning. Are you going to show them your temper? Good morning, everyone. Um, I haven't talked to you guys in a while. And I was hoping I wouldn't have to make this video. Um, I was hoping I could just like power through it. Um, this little baby, just to let you know, came in a couple days ago with um, an uh, upper respiratory. Uh, when I was contacted, they said they thought she had, he had been attacked because uh, his face, his eyes were like all swollen and stuff. And so um, they just didn't know that's what happened when kittens get up for respiratory no and he was covered weren't you you were covered in some kind of black tar you can see it he still has little pieces i've gotten most of it off but he still has little pieces on him oh it's the lighting in here is not great but between this room and my bedroom is kind of where i've been living <laughs> um i haven't filmed in a while because I have been having like since the summer and like I said I wasn't really going to talk about this um I don't really like to talk about personal stuff very much but um since the summer I have been dealing with health issues um at first I thought I was probably just anemic again but my stomach was like it, it was rough like I wasn't eating I couldn't eat I lost like 15 pounds um I was having all these tummy issues anyway long story short after many many doctors and tests um the worst stuff that is wrong with me <laughs> I have like weird little things but the worst stuff that is wrong with me is I have two ulcers um I have a bleeding ulcer and a regular ulcer. I don't know what the difference is, but, uh, cause I have seen a lot of doctors. Um, but I have two bleeding ulcers and which has made me of course anemic. And then, um, they're, they were caused by a bacteria that I have called Heliocobacter pylori. They call it H. pylori. And so I've had to be on treatment for that, which is like five, four medicines, really five, because they added an extra one, because um, I can't seem to get rid of it. Um, so, and those like really don't help. The medicines, I mean, I know they help because they're clearing up the bacteria, but they are so hard on my stomach anyway. Um, and I have had one of them cauterized and the other one they're just hoping to clear up with medication um but it's been pretty rough um and excuse the hissing baby she he was kind of semi-feral when he came in so he hisses for like no reason sometimes yes but he's very sweet i'm just i just like the hiss so <clears throat> anyway um and I thought I could push through it. I thought, you know, the videos have slowed down a whole bunch. But I thought, well, at least if I get a video a week up, you know, I'll be doing good. And then we've had so many cats and kittens. The Delta situation didn't help. Sarah has been a big help. Oh, where are you going? Oh, I haven't cleaned the litter box yet. Sorry. Um, I'm really tired. Uh, but I, I can't, I mean, I can't. So I thought I will let everybody know. So they don't think I just like abandoned them. Where are you at? What do you do? Where'd you go? I don't know where he went. Um, so anyway, uh, I do, I was hoping to be done with all of it by now. But like I said, the bacteria is not responding as well as they would have liked. Um, so next week I will have my third colonoscopy, third in since, 
September or August, August. So my third colonoscopy, which, oh, um, because that's the one there. I have one in my stomach, which they look at with an EGD where they go down your throat. But then I have one that they have to look at with the colonoscopy. And the one with the colonoscopy is the one like they're concerned about. Um, now I'm not dying. It's just painful. And I would love to be able to eat. I haven't had Taco Bell since. Oh my gosh, probably spring. That's what I told the doc because the doctors ask you what your goal is, and I said I know this is a stupid goal, but I would love to be able to eat Taco Bell. <laughs> oh, I need. I should be committed, but um, so that's where I have been um, for about a week and a half. I stayed with my mom because she was having to take me all these tests. You can't drive yourself, and you know. So she was having to take me for a while. So I just stayed with her and my son and I went back and forth like with the kittens um, and cats. But I've been back home a while. But it just, so I do nap a lot. And then when I'm not napping, I'm having to do the rescue stuff. Come here. He's hiding. Um, but I just wanted to check in and let you know. I am, um, I have filmed quite a bit actually of like the ragdoll kittens and Milo and Otis got adopted. And I think on the Milo and Otis, one of the film times I filmed that, I actually talk about this. Um, so I don't know how I'm going to do the videos. I don't know what I'm going to do to be quite honest with you. Um, because I will have a lot of energy, but then all of a sudden, I'll start, like, having cold sweat. It's just, it's ridiculous. Because I'll feel like myself, and then all of a sudden, I'll just be like, oh, and have to go lay down. But, no worries. Like I said, I'm not dying. It's just a matter of getting rid of the bacteria, and then building back up my red blood cells, I guess. I'm not sure. But they have me on like a diet and meds. It's ridiculous. Um, but I will say the videos will probably be sporadic still. I know they have been um, for a while. But fingers crossed. I'm really, really hoping to have most of this at least sorted out by the beginning of the year. Because, I mean, it's been months and months and months. Like, I know y'all don't know, but... I, we first started looking into everything in like April and here it is December now we couldn't do as much as quickly because well I'm uh, about COVID and so like our the point anyway I'm rambling now um but I will leave you with a cute little video we played dress up the other day in the nursery and then with she -Ra where um, they were, I don't know why, uh, but I just decided to play dress up with the kittens and she were and they have like little call, cute collars on and a sweater. Um, and I did film it because I was gonna actually, I do know why, I was gonna make this cute little video for a friend of mine that is sick, um, but I never got around to doing it. But I am gonna put that here next so you'll have some cute stuff to watch and not just me hollering um but i will post as often as i can and fingers crossed in a week or two or three i'll start feeling better <laughs> and i do want to say before we get to the cuteness that i hope everyone is doing well and has a happy holiday season. I am ho I mean, I know I'll put videos up before Christmas, but I do want to say have a great December.